So basically what's going to happen now is, it's very hot down here, <laughs> is now, if you could see, whoop, I took the sink out, it's not even connected, and you got the what's left of everything, kind of like if you were to demo the whole thing. So now I got to take, it's this little 90 off, <clears throat> and install, and install this. So basically what I'm going to do is, obviously this is lining up with what's here already. So all I need to do is just eyeball it, fit it to the lip, and then cut it with a hacksaw. And now that I have the sink out, I could, you know, cut that, cut it like this. All right, so I'm going to take a couple minutes to, and just see how this works here. smell the gas coming up already. Whew. So the center of the sink is right here. There's really no reason to bring it back a little bit. I guess, right? I want to just kind of get it done. So we'll cut it right here. We'll cut it right there. All right. Fucking hacksaw. Where the hell did I get a hacksaw from? Stand by. I'm trying to do this as real time as possible. So you get like a feel, excuse me, of like what's happening. Sometimes you watch videos on YouTube and if you made it this far, thanks for watching. But sometimes people are like, okay, uh, I take the sink out, I put the sink back in, thank you, have a good day, hit like. I'm trying to get, I know the camera system is not really that good, but I'm trying to get like a real feel, you know. I'm going to cut the pipe real time, you know, so like this is real feel. You know, like, you know, you watch these how-tos and they're like, okay, we'll be right back. Oh, it's all done. Like these freaking uh, auto shows when the transmission doesn't go in right away. Crappy, huh? Really should have invested a new one of these, but ain't out of bed. Oh, that's right, because it's all broken. Huh. Anyway, let's get this done. That pipe kind of comes out at an angle. You want to cut it at an angle also. PVC, any hacksaw, cut PVC just as long as you have some patience. Getting towards the end, yeah. You don't want to peel it off. You want to let the cut, let it cut naturally. And uh, there it is, for the most part. Huh. I did cut it at an angle, hmm. but shouldn't smell like shit because <laughs> it isn't there. So we'll put this off to the side. Hmm. Got the hacksaw Jim Duggan ready. And, uh, huh, you gotta just take the burrs out. And I have a napkin here because you don't want to touch it inside because there is a schmutz. Oh, it is. There is schmutz, so it could be backflow, or it could just be over the years. Oh, you know, ooh, check this out. It smells like detergent. I tell you, I knew all these years. It comes from the wash machine. I bet you the elbow is wrong. I bet you it's a, t well, uh, you know, it's flowing away. 
So you don't really want a T. You probably want that elbow that, I don't know if you could see me, that elbow that kind of goes like this, like a sweeping elbow. Obviously you can't put something in there that has like a flap so no water comes back this way because this, this is the lowest point of the house. So if it, if it overflows, the street's going to come out through here, which actually has happened twice in 30 years, if you could believe it. And that's why this thing is rotten. Um, smells like detergent. That's pretty funny. I'm assuming, assuming it smells like detergent because it, it, back, it backfills. And when the sink is on, I'm sure that's another video, is you can hear it gurgling gur, 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 when it's um, on spin cycle. You can hear the water gurgling. So, you know, we'll see. I'm gonna get a flashlight. I just want to see if uh, if I could notice notice the angle of the elbow. Unbelievable! I'm closed. And... Crap! Get out of the way! Okay, let's see. I don't know, I have a gut feeling about this trap being too big. Uh, okay. Well, I don't see nothing. I see it, but I don't. It looks like it flows. Looks like it's a T. Yeah! Looks like it's a T. Oh, excuse me. Okay, so a handy pack. Let's see, real time crime here. Take it out. I'm sure they suggest. I keep the box for now, but I'm sure they suggest. You know, usually get plumbers, they tape it. Usually plumbers get the big one. So we have a purple primer, and we have a medium clear PVC cement. Okay. Emergency made directions. Before priming the PVC, wipe the fitting with solvent welding. Fuck you. Okay, uh, handle with care, do not thin. Cut the pipe ends square. Refer to clean pipe ends. Check the dry fitting. Pipe should easy go. Excuse me, one third of the way into the fitting. If the pipe bottoms, it should be snug. Use a suitable applicator. Yada yada yada. Apply thoroughly to inside of the fitting socket and to the in outside of the surface. Apply a second coat of primer to the fitting. When the primer is still wet, use an appropriate solvent cement <coughs> for the pipe being joined. Do not uh, follow application instructions on the cement can. Do not test with air. Okay, so you put this on first, kind of like cleans it in and out of this jobby. All right. Uh, precautions, Dana, fire, spills, directions. Obviously, it's the same store in the soda. Blah, blah. Stir, stir and shake well before using. If jelly-like, don't use. Does this say stir? Uh, handle with care, prep with temperature. We'll just give a good. Oh, this is thin. Okay, uh, if jelly like, do not use. Do not thin. Cut the pipe square, blah, blah, blah. Clean it. Check the pipe, blah, blah, blah. Use a suitable applicator. Clean the pipe fitting with a, with a listed primer. They came together. Apply a liberal coat of cement to the pipe depth of the socket. Leave no uncoated surface. Apply a thin coat of cement to the inside of the fitting. So you're going to go on the outside, and then you're going to go on the inside. I mean, every home TV show, come on. So you go on the outside, and then you go on the inside, and you lean over the thing, and you, you make it look nice. I'm not going to make the video, um, how do I say it? I'm, I'm just going to do it, because I don't want to ruin it. So if you can't see it, uh, sorry. So 
So it does drip. So even though the piece on the bottom is crappy, it's still nice to protect, you know, something just because you own it. So, okay, this is going to happen. Okay? So if you can catch me, I'm going to put the purple primer on the, the outside here. I'm going to put the purple primer on this thing. I have it set loose and straight, just, you know, just because. And then I'm going to put it, a primer in here, and then I'm going to put the glue in here. I'm going to lean it over, and I'm going to, I'm going to hold it, let it sit, and then we'll move on. Back on. Okay, so the primer doesn't need to be, so I'll shake the glue. Of course, everything is solid tight on this friggin' thing. Push in, brush in can, push in can, stupid. This, this is... This is happening. All right, be right back, because everything's sealed to go to fucking NASA in this country. Okay. Pliers. Fucking A, huh? I don't want to, carefully, you don't want to bend the... No, okay. I got gotcha. you. That's messy. <laughs> Put that down there. I used to use this stuff back in the day when I did other jobs. That shall remain nameless. Nameless. Okay. This is just going to happen. Okay, excuse me, but this is more important. I like to put it on so it doesn't drip. So it doesn't look like shit. Some people you can tell when you go to your house, it's fucking plumbers. You know? Primers on. Glue's going on. Okay, wish me luck. <sighs> Here it is. <sighs> Let that set. So we don't need this right now. Close it. Oh, it's already dripping. Fuck you and your fucking mother. <laughs> it's on. It's beautiful. I'm going to show it to you. Beautiful. Beautiful first shot. Beautiful, man. I go to some of these houses through my, you know, in the years, and that purple stuff, uh, excuse me, is dripping all over the fucking place like, like some fucking ick fucking, you know, didn't know what to do about it. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to do. First time. I help you, you pay for me, I pay for you. <laughs> Probably gonna get so much flack for doing that, whatever that meant. Okay, this stains, this purple stuff I was told. So, use it. Set it and forget it, yeah! <clears throat> Careful where you put this down. You know, you don't want to get it all twatty. What I'm going to do is just, just going to put it right back in the box. Nice, beautiful. This is my little combo here, huh? Eh? Uh, can you see? A little combo. Keep it in the box. Put the box away. All right, everybody. Now's the fun part. I don't think the sink, yeah, that's a big trap, man. How is water going to stay in that damn thing? 
whatever, right? So now I have to, you know, do some stuff here, but this thing has to get glued into this thing. And this thing has to get glued into this thing, you know, and then this thing fits on the other thing. And I think it's too low and I might need a coupling. Ah, look at the old glue, it's yellow. Probably just threw it on there. Yeah, it smells like fucking detergent. This is glued in there. This was done inch and a quarter. Let's see if the name's changed. No, PVC. I don't know why he... Why he... Oh, I got a little stain here. Shit. It's all right. Not my house. All right, I'm going to put the sink back in now that it's all cleaned. Fucking tools all over the place. Probably could see it fine from where you are. Let's see if I could put the sink in. You got a good view? Oh, yeah. Well, my ass was probably in the way the whole time. Pardon my ass. My ass. Okay, so here's the sink. Very thin. Something February. No, it doesn't say that. Maybe 1987? Maybe. Looks like it's compression fitted. You know, so let's just drop this down and it's not heavy at all as you can tell. <laughs> now what you're probably supposed to do is put a bead of silicone around it. Get it all nice. See? Yeah, we got a problem already. Uh, this thing's not gonna fit. broke it. I just broke it. You saw that? <laughs> I just broke it. That's I just broke it. Ah, oh, I hit my finger. Shit. Shit. I broke it. <laughs> it's all right. I got to go to probably the home center. Maybe get a, a longer one. Oh, just broke it. Shit, just broke it is broke. You know what? We're going to get a new one. And if you want to do it right, you should have just went down. You know, this piece is fine. But if you want to do it right, you should, went, you know, should have went down. You know, and you could make this whole piece like one piece. Because I feel like this piece is restricting. And then when it opens up, it kind of like does its thing, you know. So I'm going to need this piece plus a certain amount of inches. So this piece plus, let's just say one, two, four more inches. I'm on fire back here. Fireball. I just broke it. That's pretty fun. Ugh, it's all schmutz anyway. It's a stickle here. Okay, so I got to go to the home center. <laughs> I'm probably going to buy the same thing just because it fit perfectly. I'm just going to go upstairs and check the other sink. I don't think I have extra pieces laying around. Well, hmm. <laughs> you never know. Isn't that funny? So, ow, I really hurt myself. So, let's see something here. So this piece up here screws on. So in the piece that screws on, which is not this piece. All right, we're gonna do some collective uh, thinking. We'll be right back. Yeah. 